different types. Color is bright depending on your concentration. You have enough willpower. If you bright this according to Buddha's teaching, this willpower can produce bright light. Your mind has no light, it is true, but can produce light. Such type of light is called the light of wisdom or the light of uh, nimida. Every concentrated mind is associated with wisdom faculty. When this wisdom faculty becomes powerful one, that wisdom faculty can produce, mind produce clubbers. Uncountable mind produce clubbers. The color of these clubbers is bright, depending on the power of wisdom faculty. Because of this reason, this light is called the light of wisdom. What does the browsy may cause for powerful wisdom faculty? <coughs> the browsy may cause of wisdom faculty is concentration. Concentration is the proximate cause to increase the power of wisdom faculty. When wisdom faculty becomes powerful, one, it produces strong powerful lights. Such type of light is called the light of wisdom. For some meditators, the light of wisdom appears first. But for some other meditators, Nimida appears first. What is the difference between the light of wisdom and Nimida? The light of wisdom is everywhere surrounded in your body, surrounding uh, in every direction of in every direction surrounding your body. But Nimida Abhya only on the nursery or from the breath only. The higher of the power of wisdom, the brighter the light is. So it depends on the power of wisdom, the light of wisdom being powerful. Powerful means it spread very far away from your body. The light of wisdom is in every direction surrounding your body. But Nimida appears only from the nursery, especially when you are breathing in, breathing out. The breath coming out from the your nursery, it becomes Nimida. For beginners, Nimida is your meditation object. The light of wisdom everywhere in every direction surrounding your body is not your meditation object. Your meditation object is only Nimida or natural breath. So when the light of wisdom appears, you should not pay attention to the light of wisdom. When your concentration develops further, the light of wisdom will be everywhere, in every direction surrounding your body. But for beginners, they may see maybe this side, or that side, or that side, or that side. In this way, they may see the light of wisdom partially only. This is for beginners only. But when your concentration develops further and becomes deeper and deeper, then the light of wisdom also will become stable. At that time, the light of wisdom is everywhere in every direction surrounding your body.
The light of wisdom is not your meditation object. When the light appears, if you focus on that light, very soon that light will disappear. Why? The light appears because, because of concentration on the breath object. If you change your object from the breath object to the light, the very soon light will disappear because concentration not yet stable. From one object to another object, if you change your concentration, slowly decrease. When your concentration decrease, then the light also will disappear. Because of this reason, when the light appears, you should not focus on the light. At the time, you must focus on the natural breath. When you focus on the natural breath, slowly breath coming up from the nostril will become nimitta. What is nimitta? Nimitta, the meaning of nimitta is the cause of concentration. Because of nimitta, if you can concentrate on the nimitta, your concentration develops further. Because of this reason, the nimitta is the cause of concentration. But because of concentration also nimitta appear. So they are both, they are vice versa to each other. Concentration and nimitta. Because of concentration, nimitta appears. Because of nimitta, concentration also develops further. Because of this reason, sometimes they translate nimitta as sign of concentration. But for beginners, nimitta is not stable. Why? Their concentration is not yet enough to, mean, to become mature. When their concentration de becomes deeper and deeper and becomes mature, at that time only nimitta will become stable. For beginners, usually nimitta is grey smoking color. When nimitta appears from the nostril, at that time you should not switch on your attention to the nimitta very quickly. Why? If you focus on the nimitta very quickly, very soon nimitta will appear because concentration is not yet enough to maintain the nimitta. So because of this reason, when nimitta appears, you should focus on the natural breath only. You should wait and see the breath in nimitta becomes one. Breath is another, nimitta is another. Then you should not focus on the nimitta. When the breath in nimitta becomes together, or in other words, nimitta comes up from the nostril. Our breath is begun nimitta. Then at the day you, nimitta in breath begun one. At the day you can concentrate on the nimitta. When you concentrate on the nimitta, there are some points hmm? you must take care. You should not focus on the color of nimitta. If you pay attention to the color of nimitta, when your perception change, color will be changing. Color also will be changed. So, if color is always changing, then slowly your concentration will decrease. Because of this reason, you should not pay attention to the color. Another one is 